Hi everyone, Kevin Hustick here. Welcome back to Tech Tip Tuesday. This week, I'm gonna show you how to use the updated Fish Alert button inside of Microsoft Outlook to report phishing emails or emails that you're just unsure if they're phishing or not. This is a great tool because it allows you to self-report emails and now it automatically sends us a copy in the tech department so you no longer have to forward us an email asking if it's phishing or not. So I would highly suggest that if you get a phishing email or an email that you suspect is phishing, that you leverage this feature. Additionally, if an email is determined to be clean, no before will return it to you and tell you that the email has been scanned and is safe to open. And if it's determined to be an actual phishing email, it will then scan all of our users to determine if anyone else has received it. And if they did, it will quarantine it automatically. So not only are you helping yourself, you're also helping the entire organization to keep us protected. It's really easy to use, and you can also use this in the Outlook app on Android and Apple devices. Let me show you how. Now I hopped into my email on my computer and I got this message from someone pretending to be Amazon. I'm pretty sure it's a scam or a phishing email. I first noticed it's from an email that's not Amazon and this just looks a little different than Amazon invoices I'm used to getting. And plus I know I didn't order these items. So I want to report it to Fish Alert because I want the IT department to know and I also want to help protect others that may have received this and just get it out of my inbox. So. I'm gonna click on the apps button next to the forward and I'm gonna click fish alert. And then when this sub menu opens, I'm gonna click fish alert again, which will then take the email out of my inbox. If after no before scans it, they determine it's to be safe and clean, they'll return it with a message saying that it's safe and clean to open. But I know that won't be the case here because I can tell just by the from address and the look of this, that this is not a legitimate email. Now, if I'm on an Android or Apple device, I can also use the same feature in the Outlook app. The only difference is instead of clicking the app button, that doesn't exist on the Android or Apple Outlook app. You'd click on the three dots inside the Outlook app on the email and somewhere in the list, there would be a fish alert similar to the desktop. You would follow the same prompts and the same thing would happen. And that's it. I hope you found this information useful. If you're new here, Click up here to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you'd like to watch another episode of Tech Tip Tuesday, you can click up here. That is all for now. I hope you have a great rest of your week.